24 real. That's 25 knots real wind. So the, the, if the steering gets a little squirrely, if you really have to turn hard left to stay on, then we'll start changing it down. Okay, well, I'm almost maxed out already. How fast are we going? 6.2. You got about another 45 degrees on the way up. Well, what we'll do is we'll turn up into the wind, not directly dead to the sail is flagging, but unload the sail. Okay, Mike, come on over here and help me. This is the alcohol. Okay. Dylan, come on up. You're gonna, I'm going to have you open the alcohol on my command. So you got. I'm letting out. You're going to be let, you're going to let it, be letting it pay back in, but you need to resist it because it's going to be a lot of force on the sail. Okay, head up, head up into the wind, unload the sail. Okay, release it. All the way down. Okay, now we're going to bring it back out. Yeah, pull another on there. Spoon to the teeth. You sunk it, now you're tightening it back up. Yes. Okay, head off. Yeah, roughly. Good. What happens is uh, when the wind gets too strong, more force on the back wants to turn us into the wind. See the white tape on his wheel? That's roughly wheel center. He was holding us on course with this down here. The strongest. If you don't do anything, you'll run out of rudder and the boat will just turn into the wind. Now it feels much more balanced, doesn't it? Six and a half. So, we're not, we're not doing this so much. The boat will be arm wrestling itself when it's overpowered. 